morning y'all welcome to another vlog i just got back from new york yesterday i went to an early screening of a dance with us last night it was so good my review is on tiktok you gotta go see it and now we are getting back into a routine only to leave next week okay i'm going to london for eras a week from today i actually am not quite sure we are getting back into a routine back on top of things Starting off with this run this morning, and then I have weightlifting after. I use the Nike Run Club. I'm on the 10K plan, and I have four weeks to go. So this is it. Tappy just texted me. She's, like, literally here. She's five minutes left on her run. We're going to run into each other on our run. These headphones are my favorite for running. I haven't tried it on, but I didn't need to once I found these. They sit on top of your ear. I've talked about them before. They're amazing. They don't move. You don't even feel like you're, you have anything in your ear. They're perfect. What running belt should I get? I really cannot make a decision. Maybe I get one today. I have to go to the mall. Look who it is! <laughs> I just unboxed so many packages. I'm making some breakfast. I'm making some protein pancakes. I had a great run. I had a great lifting What? Great weight lifting glass. Getting stuff done today. I already unpacked and cleaned up everything yesterday. I was just kind of like straightening up around the house, unboxing a bunch of stuff, which I'm sure you guys see there. One of my friends, Jack, is gonna come over and we have like a brainstorming session. She's a stylist, so she's gonna help style me or she's gonna style me for my London trip next week. So we need to go to the mall, get a couple things. See here? Perfect. That was perfect. There's just nothing better than the post-workout feel once you've showered and like gone ready for the day. I mean, not that I'm like ready for the day. I have my hair towel on still, but you get the vibe. You get what I mean. shopping day I've had in so long my hair is a mess I love my friend Jack she's a stylist she was so helpful um, I'll have her Instagram on the screen we're gonna start off with reformation so these things like I will have these in my wardrobe for the next 10 years I'm not exaggerating starting off strong I got a trench coat I've never had a really nice one and this one fits perfectly let me push this over it is the perfect fit. I'm not going to do a try on of these just because a lot of these are clothes that I'm going to be wearing in London and we're going to, Jack and I are going to be filming like styling for London. So I'm not going to try them on right now, but the best jacket. I mean, it's just so like luxe. I love it. All right. I've run out of hangers, so that's good. I got this top, which is just this really flattering, is peplum? Is that what that's called? Why am I saying peplum? I don't know. This really flattering top, which I will get so much use out of. And then the showstopper is this dress. It's this black and white polka dot dress. It's so flattering on. Imagine this, like out to dinner in London. The actual dress, like picture it actually on, okay? It's giving early 2000s movie in London, you know? So I love that. And then Madewell, they just reopened at North Park and it is so nice and they let me style three looks to take home with me which was so nice of them i got three new pairs of sunglasses two belts i need to show you guys these sunglasses so good first pair black circle amazing right guys i wear cute outfits i just don't well then i wear this mainly during the week but i do wear cute outfits i just feel like i never i don't like position myself i feel like it's about like positioning yourself and i'm not Oh, good. I'm glad this button's open. I'm not positioning myself. Like, I need to be documenting these cute outfits. Like, I'm in my maturing era, growing up, like, Sophia Richie rebrand kind of vibe. Even though that's already how I dress, I just need to really lean into it and take good Instagram photos, basically. So, you guys are going to have to keep me accountable. These, so good. 
Like, look at how amazing these are, okay? And then I got a pair of brown glasses. These are also amazing. I love them. Great price, and the quality is really nice. They're much better than my Amazon sunglasses that I wear all the time. I just love these. I'm not even gonna share the full looks because we'll get to that in another video. So I'm just gonna show you like haul style. But I got these two belts. Y'all know how I feel about belts. And I needed basically a gold and a silver black belt. And I love them. Also imagine these in brown. They would be so good, okay? So I need these as well. I need a better way to display my belts. Like so far, like we just have them on this hanger right now. Especially because my belt collection has really grown. What do you guys think I should do? This one is everything. Like, how fun is that bag? This one is like a super dark chocolate brown suede bag. So cute. I got a pair of just black ballet flats. These are the perfect ballet flats. I love the toe. And then I got these shoes. I'm in love with them. I'm going to wear them all the time this fall. Look at how good they are. Okay? Brown suede ballet flat. Amazing. Oh, I got these shorts so I can be trendy like everyone else and also I don't really have shorts I'm really picky with shorts and I love them <sighs> These jeans. I love you guys know how I feel about my overalls and they're barrel overalls And I love a barrel cut. I don't know. Why I've never thought to get barrel jeans They are possibly the most flattering jeans I've ever worn Ever so stay tuned because I will be wearing them every single day and I love them. Oh, I got this matching set which is very, very cute. Um, and this denim vest, which I'm sure, oh, this denim vest, which I'm sure I'm gonna end up wearing with other things as well. I also love the buttons on here. They're so cute. Why am I pointing at you guys like that? Sorry, a little aggressive. This white top, amazing, love this. This cream beige top, also amazing, love this, like with low rise. Jeans, so fun. Very successful shopping day. I feel really prepared for London. This is the best, easiest dinner. Normally, I like to go with the chunkier mozzarella. I used to make this in the townhouse all the time. I don't even think I've made it since moving, but it's so good, so easy, love. Finished, guys. Three miles. Done. Good morning, y'all. It is almost 9 a.m. I'm about to get on my first meeting of the day. Basically wearing pajamas, but I dressed it up. Today, it's just you and me. I have a lot of meetings. We need to go back to the mall. I'm sorry this has been so shopping heavy. I feel kind of like gross about it, transparently. All that stuff yesterday was gifted to me for trips to promote it. I'm actually working with a brand on a dinner party next week and they gave me a stipend because I'm like throwing the dinner party for them. So I'm gonna go to William Sonoma today and this is literally my dream. We're gonna shop for some tabletop stuff. This Kindle is single-handedly giving me the will to live. This is a birthday gift and it smells so good. I'll link the candle below, I forget the actual scent. Um, I smelled it at Anna's house when we were doing the home mine tour and it smelled absolutely amazing, so she got it for me for my birthday. It's the best smelling candle ever and it's giving fall vibes. Also y'all, we're so close to one fall vlogs, all right? You couldn't tell me that it's not fall when I get back from London. Like I am already feeling the fall energy in my house, at least for me in my house, it's fall, okay? Um, but I got a sourdough starter kit. But I'm cheating and I bought Starter off TikTok shop. Just made a TikTok about this and it's 2024, truly. And like, it's so 2024 of me to buy sourdough starter on TikTok shop, but this is the kind that Molly uses. I have literally no idea how to do this, but apparently it's a lot easier with this starter. And then we have this little starter kit. I have no idea what these tools do. But I'm just really ready to lean in to fall. Like that is what, that's what I need. We, while we're here so that we don't get boxes, we do that kind of skirt Oh, whatever, I'm just doing this for now. Okay, just doing a little check-in on the hosting closet right now. My wallpaper is almost up. Um, so I'm hosting a dinner party next week and I just kind of need to get inventory of what I already have. I know it looks like I have a lot of like tablecloths and table runners and things, but 
I thrifted a lot of these and they're not actual sets. Like these are mistakes I've made in purchasing for my hosting closet. I need to go through this and honestly donate, get rid of whatever it might be. I mean, I'll obviously give it to someone, but it's not even that they're bad things. It's that there's just not enough for a set. So I wouldn't be able to use them. Like it was just a dumb purchase for me. Um, these are just crazy. I think this is for Sophie's birthday. Who knows? Just doing a little bit of inventory before we head out to Williams Sonoma. I'm not going to get any glass or don't worry. I don't need any. These at home plates, by the way, I will link them if you guys are looking. I mean, they're kind of chipping a little bit, so that's not great, but they're very inexpensive and they are the best plates for dinner parties because you can buy a ton and they're super affordable and they match with everything. They're just pretty sleek and modern looking. Um, obviously, I love to have stuff like this. It's so much cuter, but you know, how often are you gonna use that versus these, so. I just spent a ton of time making TikToks for a friend of mine, my home lifestyle brand. Our recipe journals are available right now, as well as our dinner cards and our nightcap cards. These are conversation starting cards. They're amazing, I'm so proud of it. So many drops coming up, but, oh, we also have our recipe binders. These are our most recent launch, so if you guys love the recipe journal, you just need more space, you wanna give this to someone who's gonna need more space, this comes with dividers, tabs, it's a, it's a lot bigger, there's a lot more pages, obviously, size-wise. Um, and they're just so cute. So, so I will have it linked. I think it's always linked in the description. Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. Post-apocalyptic desert film like. Bro Okay, very successful trip. Picked up some stuff for dinner the rest of the week and my dinner party stuff. I'm back home. Let me show y'all what I got from Williams Sonoma. Stuff is so cute. These chargers, six of them. There's six people coming to the dinner and I feel like six is just a good set. In the store, they had these napkins and these napkin rings. They look cooler like, together. This pipe together was so cute. So I'm very excited about that. And then I also got these placemats, everything else I already own, but I wanted a little bit of a refresh. These things are staples that I will use for so many different things. Like you could even use these for Christmas, make them very festive, use them for the springtime so much. Same with these. I love this stuff. I stopped at Sprouts. I'm gonna make a quick lunch and then hop on at my afternoon calls. And then honestly, it just being back in my routine, like when I'm home in between a lot of traveling or just like busy schedule, I just need to like lay tonight. I think that's what I need to do. I need to lay down and I need to read a book. I started this Karen Slaughter book last week. Shannon texted me for a book rec. I gave her that, we're supposed to read it together. She's already finished, okay? Normally I finish books so fast, but I just like can't focus. So we're doing that today. Also, a little garden update. I am going to plant for fall at the end of this month. So I do need to like get rid of everything in my garden and get some compost. So, I don't know if that's happening this week. I'm tired. All right, y'all, I'm having a recharge night. I'm getting in bed early. I just ordered Froyo. I'm gonna get a little bit more work done and then I just need to read a book. Took a bath, I just self tan. I typically like at least one night a week where it's like a recharge night. I need a solo night to myself, cooking dinner, bath, the whole drawn out routine kind of vibe. Coco is insisting that I pet her as I talk to you guys. So that is what tonight is. Oh my gosh, guys. You can't even see how cute that was. She's moving, of course. I'm gonna watch that, what is it, Presumed Innocent show or whatever? Is that what it is? Maybe I'll start that. Hi y'all, happy Friday. I just made my coffee and back from my workout and my run. It was great, I ran with Tabby this morning and tonight we're actually going to a concert. It's currently like 10.30, it took forever. I just made steak and eggs for breakfast, it took so long. My friend Jack is coming over at noon, we're gonna have a brainstorming session for some work stuff and then we're gonna go through my closet and kind of start like London styling prep. 
I need to just get a bunch of random things done. It's just a productive week at home is what this is. Also guys, we need to never forget about these cups because there is nothing better than these cups. I'm so in love with them and I need every single flaw among them from anthropology. I was just recording a little podcast intro when this happened. Mm -hmm. Do you have anything to say for yourself? He's really been wanting attention this week and he got it. He got it. He loves the camera. No idea where he got that from. Okay, we had a successful day. This is the end of the vlog. I'm actually heading out to a country concert. Here is my fit. And then I have my boots, my Marnie bag. Jack actually helped me with this one as well. Tabby's about to pick me up. And then I think we're or maybe going to the stockyards. I've gone out, I think, one time this entire year. So we'll see. I don't know what my vibe is. It's normally never that. By the way, this is from um, SC Collection. I love it. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Next week is going to be London prep, and I'm throwing a dinner party, so it's going to be such a good one. I hope you guys loved, and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Not tomorrow. Next week. Okay, bye. <laughs>